Laplace's law. Laplace's law is mathematically going to give you what the force equals. The force on a blood vessel wall equals the diameter times the pressure. The force against a blood vessel wall is going to be proportional to the diameter of the blood vessels, diameter of the blood vessel times the pressure of the blood in the blood vessel. So let's look at a regular blood vessel. Here it is. And we're going to, I'm going to get a smaller arrow here. We're going to have a blood pressure pushing on the wall of the blood vessel. And that is going to maintain the shape of the blood vessel and allow it to stay open. But let's, let's look what happens whenever we have a blood vessel that is thicker. Not thicker. <laughs> I was trying to get a thicker pen. Um, we're going to have the same blood vessel. So you see we start out with the same diameter. But this blood vessel wall here is a little bit weakened. And so we're going to have an enlarged area in the blood vessel. Because of this enlarged area, it increases the diameter, right? And if we increase the diameter, then we're going to, in this our example, we're going to keep the same pressure because the blood pressure is not going to change just in this individual blood vessel. But the force against the blood vessel wall will. So if we want to draw the arrows for the force, then we're going to draw the same size arrows as we have over here in our first picture. But whenever we get to this um, area of larger diameter, the force is going to be greater. The reason that this has a bulge in it in the first place is because it's a weakened area of the blood vessel. And so what's going to happen over time is that this, this weakened area is just going to stretch even more and stretch even more and eventually it could even burst. But the pressure is going to continue to increase in that area because you have an increase in diameter and if you increase the diameter, you're going to increase the force against the blood vessel wall. This actual example that I've drawn here is an aneurysm. You've heard of an aneurysm before, and sometimes people need to keep an eye on the aneurysm, aneurysm and um, sometimes it might even burst. And the reason that an aneurysm could burst is because the force is going to increase as the diameter increases.